Hi, my name's Alex. This is my VW Polo GTI. Done a bunch of bits and bobs to it. Uh, race night intake, exhaust, Miltec all the way through, ice 20 turbo, uh, intercooler, 320 brake, 450 newton meters of torque, uh, bigger brake kit, all the Maxim design kit and that as well. Some bits and bobs in the interior, some carbon fibre. Right, this is Michel's car. We bought it 12 years ago as a, well, it was, it was literally just a body shell with nothing on it. A pair of mold grits for the steering wheel. Uh, my wife always wanted one of these from a small child at Carmen Gear. This one came up on eBay. We went to Bristol to buy it. Uh, very little on it. And then sat on it for a couple of years because I restore, well, I play with old Lancia Fulvias and Italian cars. We found the door on eBay, one of the doors, the same colour, got hold of the chap and he's the guy that stripped it down to sell it for parts and I bought all the parts back off him. Uh, some were missing, so it was expensive to buy parts for a Carmen gear convertible because they're quite unique because they're all handmade. Found the original engine, gearbox and the panels and then I restored it over a summer and the colour was chosen the colour was chosen by her mum, uh, it's a unique colour and we replicated that colour on the van which I also restored uh, three years ago or whatever lockdown was. Again, got that one as a, a very cheap non-runner uh, for a thousand pounds and then over four weeks, six weeks, I restored it to what you see today which is, was originally started off as a Danbury. Um, the van had a side opening roof which is knackered because it's fiberglass. The Westphalia is a plastic roof so they never rot. And it's the original fabric on the Westphalia we bought was completely rotten. So I, on that, on the van we scrapped, I took out all the Westphalia interior and I converted it to right hand drive because it's a right hand drive van. Whereas Westphalia's only came as left hand drive vans. And from there it originally came with this, those Porsche wheels on. I had those restored back to silver. It's uh, no welding underneath. It's, it's a really sound van. And they're the dogs. <laughs> First of our runners up is the caddy. Well done to you, sir. Congratulations. Well done. You're in the top three. Not bad going at all. And Charlotte here is going to present you with a prize from Autoglim and a certificate as well. Well done to you, sir. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for our first of our runners up. I have the pleasure of telling you that the next runner up here at Simply VW 2023 is. It's a VIP golf. Yeah. But I tell you what, you've not done bad though. Well done to you. Thank you're you. still going Thank home you. with a prize. Thank and you. let's be honest, you're going home in ultimate luxury there. <laughs> Thank you very much. You are very welcome. So please collect your prize there from Charlotte. And ladies and gentlemen, can I please ask you to put your hands together and give a huge cheer and a big round of applause for your winner here at Simple VW, Herbie. <laughs> Are you over the moon? Yes. <laughs> oh, bless you. 
You are very welcome. Thank you very much. You are very welcome. Now, come and have a look at what you've won. Here we are, ladies and gents. I'm, go I don't I'm not going to drop this. Have a look at this. This is what you've won. It is the People's Choice Award trophy. Well done to you. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for your winner. People's Choice Award, Herbie!